Hey YouTube, it's Tyler Trainer here. Welcome to another episode of Pokemon Black and White 2. So last episode we actually arrived in our in, in a new city, which is I don't even know what it's called, man. Let's just, let's just go back and forth forth. It is none other than Lacanosa Town. Hmm. And I said we're gonna have to explore it. I wanna do some exploration because we only came here in the last game after we beat the game. So I'm actually have no idea what's actually here. Also, but there is a skate Pokemon in an old folk tale. I really wanna give some I really wanna give this place some exploration because the last time we haven't actually been here. No, we don't want to put repel on right now. And we're ne we never really looked into it, we just we just have to fly and visit. So you can see a lot of the people are actually talking about the lore, which we found out last episode about a, a third legend. You know, the Zekrom Reshiram, and it turns out there's, there was another one, or oh, by by this folklore, there was an evil monster, which I presume is a legendary. M my Pokemon just runs around on its own. Maybe it doesn't need a trainer. Ooh. I, I actually didn't know Pokemon could do that. Also, free full heal, because why the hell not? I'm not gonna lie, I kinda do like this area. It's pretty cool. What are you gonna say, bro? I don't have time for anything. To I don't have anything to do ever since I took a post here. Since nobody goes outside at night, it's very peaceful. Oh, so he's obviously a security guard or something. The very big scary monster that comes out at night is a Pokemon, right? It must be a really scary Pokemon if everyone believes in the legend and follows these rules. I wonder if these guys have actually seen it. Welcome to Lacanosa Town. In this town, people live by methodically as a time... Uh, the people live as methodically as clockwork from morning to night. If you live your life soaking up the sunlight, you can sleep well at night. This is a really good logic, but might as well go and talk to Hugh because we've talked to everyone else. What's up? Have you seen Team Plasma around here? I heard a rumor that that to that effect. Oh my god, that to hear. It's Zold it's Zinolin uh, Zoldin or whatever it's called. I, I always call him Zoldin for some reason. Oh for crying out loud, this troublesome indeed. My curious traders, perhaps I should satate your curiosity somewhat. The reason I am so part of Team Plasma is, I want to know how the world will change. Listen, Pokemon are nature, Pokeballs are civil civilization. Humans who are really are used to civilization don't reclu- I can't, 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 say, can't say that, relinquish it easily enough. There we go, there we go. Of course, both nature and civilization are important. But what will happen to the world? But what will happen to, to a world taken over by Team Plasma? People will be forced to throw out Pokeballs at price of civilization. I want to know what that looks like, and I want to try to enjoy it. Oh, he's, he's, he's getting involved now. Shut your mouth. All I want to do is get a storm Pokemon back. Dan, give me a hand. You ready? I'm ready. Let's go and do this double team style. Hell yeah. So I'm actually loving the entire like Team Plasma side of this game. Like, I'm really a fan of Team Plasma because they are the evil grunts. Also, they don't believe in Pokeballs and yet they got Pokeballs themselves. A bit weird. I really do like the idea of like Team Plasma's like entire backstory in this game, and I kind of wish they went a bit like this in the previous game. Also, he's got an M Ball. Ooh, cool. So let's go for an air slash on cr Cryogen. Is that how you pronounce it? Cryogenal. By my me. And of course, we're gonna be saying oh, light screens and protect because that's what every single thing I have to do. Ooh, okay, uh, acrobatic shouldn't do too much damage. I'm honestly surprised that he actually did so much damage too. Embo, I thought I thought Embo was pretty tanky, but of course, type advantage and all that because it's a fine type. Also, have you noticed in the last? I think it's the last three Pokemon games from um, like fourth, fifth, and sixth gen. The star Pokemon for the fire type has ended up being a fighting type. No, it's not. It's a uh, it is Gen 3, 4, and 5. That's a bit weird, don't you think? That's a tad strange. I don't really, I, don't, I, I couldn't care less, to be honest, but I just find it a bit strange. Okay, Garbage. Come on, Nagi, be faster. You should be faster. You should be faster. Ooh, Tips using Hyper Potion. We don't need Hyper Potions, it's fine, you know, it's fine. It's fine. But, like, you know what I mean? Like, there was Combustion, there was Infernape, and now there's Imbol. Why, why is Fire type Pokemon and Fighting it's such a good combination? Like, I'm really a fan of him, to be honest. I'm honest about it. He's probably gonna get poisoned here, because, yep. For some reason, everyone gets poisoned in this game, no matter what you do. I kinda wanna get rid of Kyrogenol, just because it is an ice type, and ice is gonna rinse, like, bloody Daco if I don't get rid of him pretty fast. Leap Blade, go on, Ky Kyrogenol. 
Lee Blade, it should probably end him easy enough. I'm so surprised how fast the Daco actually is. He is so tanky. Okay, Embar shows how he's done. End him, come on. I'm trying to go in for some kind of, um... Ooh, what's weak armor do? Oh, it's, it, his defense fell, but his speed rose. I'm not gonna lie, that is a pretty cool ability, and that will be really useful in, like, competitive battling. I am so surprised Embar didn't actually go for Flamethrower, though, due to stab. Since I'm pretty sure it would have done the exact same damage. What do I really know? Sneasel can be a bit annoying because it is an Ice Dark type, but I feel like it w we're going to be able to be fine here. Like, unless you got like Ice Beam or something, but guess what? We don't need it. Sneasel is actually really weak. Like, it's obvious to say Sneasel is a pretty cool Pokemon. Like, it can actually learn Focus, like, um, Fall Swipe even, which makes it really good for Legendaries and stuff, but yeah, it, it, it's really weak in, in, uh, w compared to its like, evolution, Weavile. But uh, we beat the grunts. What a blunder I, I have made in front of Zeldin. The pressure I felt from you now. Ooh. We got like 9.5k. What's with these two? I'm battling alongside Zenolin. This shouldn't be happening. These trainers remind me of the one from two years ago. More importantly, we must continue our search. Like the scientist, like, like the scientist said, it might be an Opal Lucid City. We'll play with you again later. Oh my god, they're actually going to Opal Lucid City just like us. Get back here! And Tapus is obviously going to chase him down. What's actually in this house here? I wonder if it's going to be something cool. Oh, it's empty. Can I actually want to sleep in the bed? No. It's not, it's not as fun. Also, can we actually open this up? The trash is empty. Fridge? Nope. So yeah, we've literally completed this area of the game. How short was that? You know, like, honestly, there's, there's only a lot to do, but in this area, not so much. There are a lot of people in this world. And there are just as many different characteristics and ideas. That's actually a really, like, a really, really deep point. You know what I mean? Like, it's right, there's, like, so many different ideas people have, and, and everyone's different. Like, and nobody thinks the same way, and everyone's their own unique character. Wow. Deep as hell. But let's heal up, and let's continue on our Pokemon journey now that we've actually completed this town. To be honest, I'm so surprised that, um, Lycanus of the town is actually here. Also, we did have to actually fight that battle, because... If not, we could actually leave. So, nice to know. And with that, we actually arrive on Route 12. To be honest, I'm surprised how short this route has been. Uh, what's, wait, wait, what's this? What, what is this trainer tips? Try Pistons Light while organizing a Pokebox. It, it'll let you move your Pokemon around more easily. The more Pokemon you deposit, the more boxes you'll have. Oh, I actually did not know that. I actually had no idea that like, the more the more you actually do de deposit, the, the more things you have. But we're going to actually from the Dow's machine as well as the... Good old max repels, because we need them. We'll, we need to use them as much as we can. Also, let's actually continue war in this area. Oh my god, there's so many items. So many items. Fight me, come on, fight me. Yes, there we go. But if you remember, in the last game, we actually went north of uh, Inoa Polluted City. We didn't actually go, like, east. But this, this game, obviously, we're going to be coming from the east, which is actually... I kind of do like when Pokemon games do it a bit different. I loved it in Platinum, and I kind of like it in this more than the... More than the um, the original, you know, the original black and white. I feel like it's done really well because you're actually like looking at it in a new area. Also, Heracross, a pretty cool Pokemon, especially when it gets its Mega Revolution, the sixth generation. Pretty cool Pokemon. Also, I'm shocked how much damage that actually did, if I'm honest. But I really, really like the fact that um, they tried to add like a little twist. It's not just like a sequel like uh, the first three generation was. They tried to make it a bit different and add to the story. And I really like it, you know. I kind of wish with. Um, why Pokemon X and Y and all that uh, when they made the sequel which they never did sadly what the hell which I'm really annoyed about I no she's gonna stop on the hidden item what no I want to get the hidden item but I'm not gonna lie type advantage here it's working pretty goddamn well for us yeah oh I really wanted to oh I'm gonna have to leave and come back aren't I just to even get the hidden item oh god damn you hidden items and your load of rubbish Ah, uh, it's fine, it's fine. So, uh, that's just gonna give Nagi another level up, though. Jesus Christ, Nagi is getting these levels. As you can see, a lot of the Pokemon are actually getting pretty strong now. Level 40s, that's pretty powerful. Like, I think I mentioned this in a previous episode. Like, we haven't even got the 8th badge or the 7th badge yet, and yet we're fighting level 40s. The 7th and 8th badge has to be close by, because... I know it's one in Opal Lucid City, because it was mentioned previously, but... Jesus Christ, the amount of, like... Actual stuff going on here. Let's actually make, make these trainers move again. I don't know if you notice, but if you leave the screen and come back, the, the, the trainers will actually walk. So 
Nice to know. I'm actually a rare candy, so that definitely was worth it. Rare candy actually increases your Pokemon's level by one. A great item. It's literally one of the best items in the entire game. Also, free timer ball. I mentioned those when we actually fought the first legendary two episodes ago. Um, oh no, it was the last episode, wasn't it? When we fought, yeah, it was the last last episode when we actually caught our first legendary in the game. How much better? One of these is actually a fake Pokemon. Also, so many items, man. So many items. Wait, what are you? A yellow shirt. I'm not gonna lie, this item is so. This area is so rich for items. I'm not complaining. Like, okay, what's this? And a max repel. Jesus, man. This is seriously worth just coming straight through. Just like, just get the items. I know there's a, a double battle there. We're gonna get me getting that in a second. But wow, we got three max potions as well. Jesus Christ. I'm pretty sure in this area you can actually find certain bug type Pokemon here. You can actually um. Actually, is that here? I don't actually know. I think it is. Uh, you, you can actually catch Pinsir, Heavycross, Combi, and Vespaquen. So, uh, nice to know. I, I think it's here. It must be. Yeah, yeah, it must be. Um, and that's the only place you can actually find them other than in the Lost Lawn for Forest. So, if you want to get some of the OG like Pokemon like Heavycross, Pinsir, Combi, and Vesp Vespaquen, yeah, you might as well get them here because I'm not going to lie. Those Pokemon aren't bad. They are really, really good. Especially that Pinsir. Oh my god, what move is this? Ringing out. Oh, it's got 5pp. The user powerful it rins the target. The more HP the target has, the greater the power has. Oh. Okay. I'm actually going to actually get rid of Coil for that. I'm, I'm curious. Because... So, will it not one hit then? Right, running it out? So it means obviously that like, the higher HP stat the, pers the person's got, like for example Snorlax, would do a lot more damage. I'm really curious on how this would work. Also, why did you poison Nagi, Roselia? Why the hell? I hate Toxic, man. They only ever do it when they're losing. You know, like, Toxic is actually a really good move, especially in competitive. But, uh, Toxic, man. It's like, it, it doubles the damage of poison each turn. So, for example, if it, if it does two damage on one turn, it would do four now. Then it would do eight, instead of, like, doing two, four, eight. You know, it... it it's a bit too powerful, Toxic, to be honest. I'm not really a fan of how powerful it actually is. Okay. I just want to see if there's anyone else to fight around here. Also, for some reason, Toxic isn't actually going off. Hmm, that's a bit weird. Well, we're going to go and heal up. I'll see you guys in a second. And so, guys, we are now back. We're just walking back through the route. And this is the end of Route, route 12. That was pretty goddamn short, wasn't it? And now we're actually on a new route. But I do think it's about time we actually end off the video here. So, if you enjoyed this video, please give a like. It would be greatly appreciated. Next time, we're going to explore... The Village Bridge. I'll see you guys then. Peace.